Boombox! For the last time for this one. Hey guys, welcome back to another Final Fantasy XIV Minion Mascot Volume 3 unboxing. And here's our last one. Also, strangely enough, a tattoo. Okay, let's get rid of the box by whacking everything on the way. And we'll have a look at the Kid Dragoran Minion plush. Oh, oh my god, that's so soft. Probably because it's like, it's very hollow. Oh, that's really soft. I love how soft that is. The rest, not quite. Ooh, that's felt. I like that. They've made the the jacket out of felt, so it feels like a different material. Makes sense. Same with the leaves, which are very, very loosely attached compared to the stalk, which is very strongly attached. Ooh, we've got another free here, which you cannot see. Lovely. That was a blonde one. We have Dancy Kid Ragara. He whips his thing back and forth. As always, Taito, Final Fantasy XIV. And... Ooh, what's this word? The Min Eon Mascot Volume 3 Kid, Kid Ragara. Good old Kid Ragara. So, yeah, the Kid Ragara. Little plushy thing of a little plant person. With a very distended forehead. So, as always, very cute. But, just showing off how cute it is. Definitely, I would recommend getting these. If you can get your hands on them, do. Especially, well, obviously, if you're a fan of Final Fantasy XIV, you'll want these. They are, they are beautiful representations of the in-game minions. But, as always, wait, so... The cha I just realised, they've made that material different because it's his jacket. But that is also, like, that's meant to be part of the jacket and that is too. That's why there's crosses there. But that's, whatever. Hope you enjoyed this. Stick around for the in-game footage of the actual minion. And I'll catch you in the next one, I guess, for ugh, volume four. I wonder what minions we'll have. I hope that we get a Midgard Soma or the, the Wind-Up Dragonette. <laughs> so anywho, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.